Hello children, what you're going to be doing today is cutting out some uh, flowers, actually the, the flowers are cut out for you, like the flower heads and the stalks and the uh, leaves, but you're going to construct them, so you're going to put them together and you're going to do a flower within a flower within a flower of different colours of your choice, okay, it's lots of, sort of gluing and sticking and things like that and lots of care, I've done it because I want you to sort of really show how much care and focus and uh, not rushing your work as well okay so i hope you have fun with this and i can't wait to see the results if you get time do more than one okay cheers take care bye bye okie dokie then children uh, we're going to start our flowers now and this is what you're going to do you're going to have some of these and some of these hearts of different sizes and colors and some leaves of different colours and sizes. And, and you're gonna have about three of these, one in the middle and two diagonally. See, one there, one there. And just focus on making one today because this is your time I'm using up, okay? But you'll be able to see it speeded up. Sped up, speeded up, yeah. Um, get some glue, but not too much, and just put it on the back, okay? Just sort of spread it about, but it's so important that you don't use a lot. Because if you use a lot, you're going to be putting your hands in it. It's going to get really messy and really, I think it might be a bit too long. If they're a bit too long, then you just take some off the end, okay? And I think that should be all right. And add about there, okay? And I'll keep that for later. A bit of dinner. <laughs> Not really. Um, yeah, I'll do another one. Take a little bit off the end. And I'll, I'll do that one in a moment. And then you get some uh, flower heads, okay? And what you do with that is, I'm looking for uh, a nice big one now. And then you put them on these, but you fold them over first of all. Fold them over like that, press down. This is why why you don't want loads of glue because you don't want to get it all on here yet. Then you just get a little bit again and put it on the back, what you call the spine of the flower, like so. Like that, put it on there like so. Press down neatly. Fold it like that and sort of bring this up again once more, taking great care. That's it. Just leave it like that. It'll dry naturally in place. It should do anyway, hopefully. Perhaps I should leave it. But actually leave it, leave it for a bit like that. But you don't want glue on the back of here, just this bit on the back of there. So like so. Okay. Just on the back of this here. And I'm going to do another one. I think I'll do a blue one actually, that will really stand out against the pink. You can choose whatever colours you want, fold it very neatly, a little bit of glue, and what you're going to see next is going to be sped up. Okay, so. So you can see what I've done there. It's overlapping there, but that doesn't really matter because it's all going to be fairly 3D. And when these are dry, you'll be able to open these up really carefully. You push down and then close them like that and then they kind of open, close them like that. So they're flat and then close them, but you sort of push down so it's still, the glue is still sticking on there. And this is really good for you using your fingers and your hands because it's about control and care. So let's try it again. Push down, that's it, very firm, but also at the same time managing to be gentle. Yeah, there you go. And they're a little bit three-dimensional now. 
So, um, yeah, there you go. I might give you bigger sheets of paper to do these on, actually, than the ones I've demonstrated on now, okay? So, uh, yeah, I think I will, because you can get another flower in there as well. Okay, good luck with this one, children. I'm sure you'll be fantastic. Can you see it okay? Good luck.